You see, if we all just take a moment, it kind of works, doesn't it? Got the radar on. That was a mistake. <laughs> Riding around town. That's going to do nothing but beat. Boop, 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 boop. Yeah. It's going to be quite a lot of that today, I think. <laughs> Will it change? It doesn't matter because I can turn left. Takes me pretty much to where I want to go anyway. You know that thing about the best way to get fit on a bike is to ride a bike. So the road bike is out of hibernation and a quick ride around town. Saturday morning, about 8.30. The other half of the wheeler operation is enjoying the technology of blackout curtains in bed. But uh, we have two different ways of looking at uh, getting back to fitness at this moment. All right, don't hit the pine needles. <laughs> Okay, down through Merrick Park. That means first half of this ride is going to be sort of downhill and flat. Yeah, second half of the ride is going to be a little bit more uphill, but uh, I can't imagine there's going to be any more than about seven, eight hundred feet of climbing. Got the uh, the road bike out. It's been in hibernation for a while. Haven't ridden it really, and uh, had a go on it the other day. Remember just how good it was. Thought I'd get it out again. This is still quite a hill to start with. It's not that long, fortunately. But uh, the mechanical Ultegra is just spot on so far. <laughs> I don't want the lights to change because it'll feel like I have to run for them. Oh God. <laughs> yeah, all good. All right, you got it. Yeah. All good. Made it to the top. <laughs> a little bit huffy puffy, but still made it to the top. No problem. Wrong side of the road. Oh my goodness, look at that out of control cyclist. Very tempting to cut the corner. Probably not best in a door zone. Oh, perfect timing. Car just coming up behind me. Yep, they're following. Plenty of room there. Yeah, they are being cautious. Thank you. Leave her alone. Well done. A little bit close behind. They were behind me as well, actually, but they did take caution when it came to the actual overtake, so, okay. Okay, all clear. All right, a little slog up to Canford Cliffs. 
Uh, yeah, go on then. Single speed style. Good morning. Cool, that one's a stinger, isn't it? <laughs> Car right. And recover. Recover, I said. <laughs> and there's the difference. Yeah, recovery time. It's not good. It's not easy though. Not like it used to be. Right, where are you going, Mr. P? Hold on. There we go. Shore Road, Port Harbour. I'm not going out for the uh, ferry today. I'm going to go back into town. It all gets a little bit boring from here, I'm afraid. Well, not quite so pleasant to look at, let's say. Yeah, so weekend football training started. Traditionally a winter sport. But I must admit, there's not much of a break in the summer anymore. Not at the highest levels. I'm assuming it's a winter sport in the southern hemispheres as well, but maybe you can uh, confirm or correct me on that. Yeah, so Julie and I are going for two completely different ways of getting back to fitness. Julie's joined the gym, she's going to do her circuits. I'm going to ride my bike as often as I can. Not every day probably, but every other day I would think, if I can. Maybe even twice at the weekends. Julie enjoys the technology of blackout curtains at the weekends, which is fair enough, it's the weekend. You know, try and save all the things you've got to get up for in the week, even if you're not working. Have a lay in at the weekend. Do what your body's already used to. means I can get out early and just go for a ride at my own pace. Cyclocross. <laughs> so this is an extension of the bike path from Whitecliffe round to Beta. Lovely and smooth at the minute. The water does actually wash up onto this one. There are patches of seaweed as you go along. I could cycle over the cycle path. I think you're allowed on the path because that's a shared path next to us. Anyway, this is a twin sails bridge. Sometimes it opens, sometimes it stays open, sometimes it does actually close again. It's a bit of a lottery, I think. But uh, anyway, fortunately, the one over there, the old original Paul Harbour Bridge, works just fine. <laughs> oh, the legs are going to go like jelly. <laughs> Come on. Don't make me stop, please. <laughs> oh, dear. 
<laughs> look at that. See, hand clipping works every time. I did say this half of the ride, not so pretty, didn't I? Anyway, it'll be quieter in a minute. Still not pretty, but it'll be quieter. Okay, here we go. The long climb. Up to Wimborne. And then we'll cut across back to home. Keep going. Cars can wait. All right, let's get away from the traffic for a minute. Onto the trailway. This bit of the trailway. No problem on a road bike. Oh, <laughs> pooch. Morning. Morning. That'll do it. All right, I've slowed down, so of course everything's getting a bit sweaty. I'll be a little bit careful along here. The view into the distance is not great along this bit. There's a few tight corners, but uh, once we get up onto the top, you can see for a long way. Uh. Oh, not too bad. <laughs> Lovely and smooth. The thing is, to cut through for so the bikes there, green and mildew, try and avoid those. Oh, this is so much better. It's all been resurfaced. I'm having that. Even with disc brakes. Yeah, that would have been a struggle, wouldn't it, to stop? Looks like they're putting a bike path in on the left here as well. The other side's done. You do have to get off it for a while. But you know, that's okay. I'm guessing that it'll end here though, because I can't see how there'll be space for it to continue Oh no, you go back onto the old road one there. Yeah. Hopefully they'll renew these lines. Eyes up, all directions. Attack speed, but not full speed. No, not today. Go on, well done. Yep. Right. All good. Right, it's gone green, I'm staying out. Go on, come on. Yeah, well done, mate, let's go. Yeah, the car jumped it behind me. I'm glad I made that decision. Right. This is Kinson. Been here a long time. Mentioned in the Doomsday Book. Yeah, so the Doomsday Book. I think most people in the UK would know what that is, but for everyone else. It was like the first census. Yeah, William the first, first census, 
not necessarily of the people or the peasants as it would have been back then but certainly the landowners oh there you go i felt pretty good on that one i'll be honest 25 miles about an hour and a half ride time yeah enjoyed that well if you made it this far into the video thank you for watching click the like button because it proves you've watched it that's why google liked the like button and uh join us for the next one <laughs>